This is the Airbus A340-600, an engineering marvel that once held the title of the world's longest commercial aircraft. Developed as part of Airbus's ambitious strategy to dominate long-range travel, the A340-600 stretched the limits of aviation design with its impressive length of 247 feet or 75 meters and range capabilities. Airbus officially announced the development of the A340-600 in December 1997. This variant was envisaged as a direct competitor to Boeing's 747, offering similar payload capabilities but with better fuel efficiency thanks to its four smaller engines. The aircraft was powered by Rolls-Royce Trent 500 engines, which were specifically developed for the A340-500 and 600 series and the design featured a stretched fuselage, making it the longest airliner in the world at the time of its development, and a number of technological advancements such as increased use of lighter materials and more sophisticated avionics compared to its predecessors. The maiden flight took place in 2001. The type received its European and American certification in June 2002, and the first A340-600 was delivered to launch customer Virgin Atlantic in July 2002. Virgin Atlantic was one of its most enthusiastic supporters, utilizing the aircraft's range and capacity to expand its long-haul network. Stay with us till the end of the video because here is everything you need to know about the Airbus A340-600. Stepping inside, the aircraft boasts a cabin width of about 17.4 feet or 5.3 meters, which allows for a versatile cabin layout, typically arranged in a three-class configuration. The cabin height, standing at 8.4 feet or 2.56 meters, contributes to a more spacious and airy environment. The aircraft typically accommodates between 320 and 370 passengers, though configurations can vary depending on airline specifications. The seat layout is flexible. Airlines often opt for a mix of first, business, and economy classes. In first and business classes, the A340-600 features lie-flat beds that significantly enhance passenger comfort on long-haul journeys. Economy class provides a standard yet ergonomically designed seat which aims to maximize comfort. Regarding seat dimensions, the pitch varies by class. In economy, the pitch can range from 31 to 32 inches or 79 to 81 centimeters, providing adequate legroom. Business class offers more generous space, typically between 60 and 64 inches or 152 to 162 centimeters, while first class often exceeds this range, offering expansive space and privacy. The overhead bins are designed to accommodate the modern traveler's needs, capable of storing standard-sized international carry-on luggage. Talking about in-flight entertainment and connectivity, most aircraft are equipped with personal screens offering a wide range of movies, TV shows, games, and music. Additionally, USB ports and in some cases, AC power outlets are available at each seat. Wi-Fi connectivity, though dependent on the airline, is generally available. The cabin's LED light the lighting system is tailored to reduce jet lag by mimicking natural phases of the day, which helps in adjusting the body's internal clock to the time zone changes, and noise and vibration levels are significantly lower compared to older generations of aircraft. The pressurization and air circulation systems are state-of-the-art, designed to maintain a cabin altitude of approximately 8,000 feet or 2,440 meters at cruising altitude which helps in reducing the effects of altitude sickness and dehydration. The air quality is continuously refreshed every two to three minutes, ensuring a supply of clean air and aiding in passenger comfort and health. Lastly, the lavatories are equipped with modern amenities and are designed to be accessible and functional. They are strategically placed throughout the cabin to ensure ease of access for all passengers, thereby reducing wait times and congestion. Now let's step into the cockpit. Central to the flight deck's operation is the electronic flight instrument system, which displays critical flight information across six large LCD screens. This setup includes the primary flight display and the navigation display for both the captain and the first officer, as well as two shared engine warning displays and a systems display. The PFD integrates flight dynamics information, such as altitude, speed, and attitude, while the ND provides a comprehensive view of the flight plan, weather radar, navigation aids, and traffic information, crucial for situational awareness during all phases of flight. The A340-600 uses the Airbus flight management system, which is adept at handling the complexities of long-haul flight routing, including performance optimization across different flight phases, fuel efficiency calculations, and automated systems management. The FMS interfaces seamlessly with the auto flight, navigation, and performance systems, creating an integrated approach to flight management that reduces the possibility of human error and enhances flight safety. Autopilot functionalities are highly sophisticated, 
capable of managing virtually all from takeoff to touchdown, depending on pilot preferences and operational requirements. This includes advanced features such as auto landing and auto throttle systems, which are essential for managing the demanding long haul operations the A34600 often performs. Communications equipment adheres to the latest standards, including multiple VHF and HF systems, which provide robust and reliable communication links with air traffic control and company operations. SATCOM is also integrated, allowing for constant connectivity, even over remote areas. The avionics suite also includes comprehensive systems for surveillance and situational awareness. It is equipped with modern traffic collision avoidance systems, weather radar with predictive wind shear detection, and advanced terrain awareness and warning systems, which are indispensable for ensuring safety in varied and challenging flight environments. Airbus has also incorporated various updates over the years to keep the systems in line with new regulations and technological advances. These updates include improvements in GPS technology for enhanced accuracy and navigation, upgraded ILS systems for better landing precision in poor weather conditions, and updates to digital maps and databases that feed into both the navigation and the warning systems. Now let's talk about the engine, performance specifications, and how it flies. The Airbus A34600 is powered by four Rolls-Royce Trent 556 engines, each producing up to 62,000 pounds of thrust. The aircraft requires 11,200 feet or 3,400 meters of runway to take off at sea level on a standard day with a maximum takeoff weight of 840,000 pounds or 380,000 kilograms and a maximum payload capacity of 146,000 pounds or 66,000 kilograms. The engines allow a maximum rate of climb per minute of 2,000 feet or 610 meters and a maximum cruising altitude of 41,450 feet or 12,635 meters. The plane has a maximum speed of Mach 0.86 or 400 93 knots, a maximum cruise speed of Mach 0 0.82 or 470 knots, a maximum range of 7,800 nautical miles, which is 9,000 miles or 14,450 kilometers, and a minimum landing distance of 5,900 feet or 1,800 meters. And finally, the base purchase price for a new Airbus A34600 is $330 million before options. Thank you for staying with us till the end. Here are two videos you can watch next. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.